Peter's confession to Jesus at Caesarea Philippi when Jesus asked the disciples who the people thought he was, they gave answers ranging from the prophet Elijah to a reincarnated John the Baptist. The disciples spent much of their time listening to Jesus teach and preach, and watch him perform numerous miracles including, raising the dead back to life. When Jesus asked the disciples, who they thought he was, Simon Peter replied, You are the Christ, the Son of the living God. Jesus said, Blessed are you, Simon. My heavenly Father has revealed this to you. And so I say to you, you are Peter, and upon this rock, I will build my church. Jesus said to Simon Peter, I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth will have been bound in heaven, and whatever you release on earth will have been released in heaven. Jesus then instructed all the disciples not to tell anyone that he was the Christ and added, The Son of Man must suffer many things and be rejected by the elders, chief priests, and experts in the law, and be killed, and on the third day be raised. The role that Simon Peter held has now been passed to Pope Francis. He humbly asks us to pray for him. Almighty God, look kindly on your servant Pope Francis, you chose him to shepherd your flock. Guide and protect him in his daily work, inspire him in your ways. St. Paul, guide all priests and religious. Help them realize that their actions speak louder than any words. Teach them to use their talents to convey God's message but, to rely above all, on the promptings of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Listen and reflect. Pause and talk. 21st August, Senior Citizen Day Give thanks for the work done by our senior colleagues, often voluntary and at considerable personal cost. May they continue to enlighten and help us as we say this prayer of thanks, Our Father.